All right, guys, even here, and this is Tim Budesheim. I believe I pronounced his name right. I used to learn German in elementary and high school, but I don't really speak it. I don't know much about this guy. All I know that he placed sixth this New York Pro and that he is 29 years old, so that's very, very young. And I also know another thing, and that's that he looks amazing in this pose. He just looks freaking crazy. And reminds me a lot of Mike Materazzo. I don't know about you guys if you can see it, but I can see it definitely. Aside from that, he's very conditioned, he's very full. He doesn't have any weaknesses. He is very complete, right? He doesn't lack any body parts, as you can see. His legs are world-class legs. He has great conditioning. And uh, people used to comment in my videos when I made my New York Pro uh, prediction video, talking about this guy that he's gonna surprise us all. And he certainly did surprise me. He placed sixth, beating James Hollingshead by two spots. So he presented himself very, very good. And taking sixth place at the New York Pro is a huge achievement. By taking that sixth spot, he put himself on the radar. Judges are more aware of his existence right now. And this is a big achievement, sixth place. And also, I believe that he could have placed higher. I would give him a higher placing probably than John De La Rosa, for example. I don't know, he looks more impressive to me. He had better conditioning, but that's just how it goes, you know, you need to pay your dues. You can't just appear all of a sudden from nowhere and take one of the top spots. It doesn't work that way. It's wrong, I agree, it's not how it's supposed to be, but it's the way it is, because this is a very subjective sport and it's only details that will separate first, second, and fifth place, and uh, if you are not well established, they will not compare you, they will not even look at you. You will not draw attention to their eyes. But I do believe that this guy was overlooked, and I do believe that he's going to make great things in the future. We'll see what shows he will do next. Maybe he will even qualify for the Mr. Olympia. Who knows, because he really looks great. His back could use a little bit more work, as I can see, and his hamstrings, but everything else is one point, pretty much. Chest is great, shoulders are awesome, big arms, Really good legs, really good legs. Back is fine, he's very conditioned as well as glutes. Maybe he could add a little bit more mass in his upper back and his lats as well. But that's about it as far as I can see. Hamstrings and a little bit to his back. Everything else is really, really good and he has great conditioning, which combined with very, very hard and dense muscle makes his physique look really, really impressive. And look at the vascularity as well. So let's wait for a second until he turns around. From the front everything looks perfect, but from the back, yeah, here you can see that his lats are a little bit weaker, and his mid-back. So that's his weakness. If he can improve that, and I'm pretty sure that he can, he can do great. His hamstrings as well. So that's my criticism about his physique. Very, very small changes are required for him to be great. This pose is amazing. This is really, really good. And wait a second when he does the most muscular. It kind of reminds me of Dallas McCarver, rest in peace. Right? Look at this here. Yeah, yeah. This guy is a beast. He's definitely a beast. And if you have any more information, if you are German, for example, tell me in the comment section below. Inform me about him a little bit more. I want to know more about him. When did he turn pro? What are his plans? Whatever information you have about him, tell me in the comment section below. As you can see, I read all the comments and I reply to most of them as much as I can. Anyways, this is it about Tim Budesheim. So definitely a huge surprise, this New York Pro, and I believe this guy is a huge prospect. I believe that he will be at the Mr. Olympia very soon. So thank you very much, guys, for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, like it. If you want to see more bodybuilding content like this, subscribe to my channel. All the best, guys. Bye-bye.